Hi everyone, today we're going to be doing a review and unboxing on the Talking Percy. This is the newer version from All Engines Ago. Uh, it's a 2023 model. It came out in America first. Very big disrespect to the British. Um, bought it from Smith's Toy Superstores for a kind of strange offer. So basically, if you buy three Thomas engines, you get one for free. Um, so we're gonna go and unbox this now. You know, I really love the barcode, how it has Thomas on it. Uh, yeah, let's get it out and let's see how Percy wheels on the rails. Also, this thing, it's got a nice um, little hole so you can feel the texture of that little truck there. Yeah, let's open it. Okay, so I got Percy out of the package. I tried my best to save the packaging. Um, I've done a better job than what my five-year-old self would have done. Anyway, let's get to the rolling stop first. So here is this very unique, this is like a new wagon compared to the old one. I thought you could actually put in a push along in there, but no, too big. Can't put him in. He's too fat. Oh, I can't say that. It's 2024. Ooh. Anyway. Uh, I like this little wagon. It's got a very nice texture to it. Um, yeah. This next one is just the same as the other one, but it's got some boxes on it. Nothing special. Just a little code in there. And then you've... There's the wagon. Ghislaine Thomas 2021. But this came out in 2023. Well, you know what Mattel like using the same moulds. Now let's get to the main man himself, Percy. So what I want to show you first, if you don't know, these two little things at the back, when it's in the box, these are held down to activate the try me mode. And when once they're released, it goes into play mode. It's basically to just to stop the train from moving in the box. So yeah, there he is running. I'll let you hear his phrases in a minute when I get him on the track. Uh, Get him on and let him have a chat with the other engines. I need you to have a chat with the other engines. Right. Come on, Percy, let's get you on the track. Right, so the layout I'm going to be using for this review is the 2015 Thomas and Skiff set. Because it's the only set I actually own currently. With the most modern Trackmaster track. Um, see, the thing is, I wasn't really a Trackmaster person back in the day, so... I don't have a lot of it. Um, I have ordered some more, so hopefully in upcoming reviews, I can, you know, get a bigger layout. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, let's set Percy off and see how he whirls on the track. Okay, I was expecting more Mattel. You're advertising this as a talking and making sounds type toy train and it's just going round and you only get it to talk if you have another train in the close proximity to make it talk. Or you have to press it and make it stop. Surely it would be better if it was making sounds when it was going round. Okay, maybe it does make some sounds without another engine, but... Mm. You know, I'd prefer it to play, maybe make, have a conversation to itself, or a conversation to the person playing with it. That would be a good idea. I mean, I get the marketing of the toy is for it to talk to other trains and that's how they make more money to make it talk you've got to buy another train but yeah anyway 
forgetting my very, very crappy criticism. Overall, the toy, I like it. It's a nice addition to my Tom, well, <laughs> my Percy collection. You should see it. If you want me to make a video on my Percy collection, please put in the comments below because my Percy collection is ridiculously massive. And I think that is a thing with a lot of Thomas collectors. You seem to get this horn of Percy's. Honestly, they're everywhere. Um, and I, th I think I have more Percy's than Thomas. I think. Anyway. That is the end of this video. Um, if you want to do a review on the Talking Thomas over there with Annie and Clarabelle. Or the Talking Gordon from the CGI series. That my friend Elias got for me. Or... You want me to have a review on the Talking James when it arrives uh, in a few days. Or I could do a video on the motorized Toby. Okay, it's not I could do a video. I am going to do a video on that one because I bought it purposely to do a video. And also this whiff model, if you'd like me to. Um, is whiff do it worth doing a vid video on? Of course he is. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye for now.